Hi, my name is Frank Martinez. I'm a principal architect here at TIPCO Software and I work on Project Flogo. Let me show you how easy it is to get started with Project Flogo in just a few minutes. Project Flogo is an open source project for IoT integration and application development. It is ultra lightweight and has a simple web UI and powerful Go SDK to extend and embed into your IoT applications. If you want to get started quickly, we recommend you use our web UI to build your first Flogo flow and package it into an app. As a prerequisite, you should have Docker installed. Head over to flogo.io and you'll find the command to install and start the web UI. Just copy and paste it into your terminal and it will pull down all the required Docker images. In just a couple of minutes your environment should be set up and you'll be ready to build your first flow. Once you have the web UI installed and running, open up your browser and go to localhost port 3010. The UI will present you with a quick overview on the steps needed to build your application. First you have to add and configure a trigger that will kick off your flow. Next, you'll add and configure activities, which your flow will execute. Then you can run and test your flow. Finally, you can build your application and be able to deploy it. Now, let's get started. Let's create our new flow. First, select Create New Flow and type in the name of your flow. Now, We'll add a trigger. A trigger is what will kick off our flow, and in this case, we're going to create an HTTP trigger. We'll set the port to be 9121 and make the operation a simple get. The path that will kick off our operation will be test. Save this, and now we'll add a simple log activity, which we'll use to display a hello world message. Now, once we've done this, we can build our application for various platforms. We can make a copy of it. We can export it for use in the CLI. We can also export it so we can import it into another web UI instance. Now, if you're like me, you'll probably want to check out the CLI and see some sample code. Just head over to the Flogo CLI GitHub repo and check out the installation and getting started sections. There are a couple of prerequisites needed in order to run the Flogo CLI. Make sure you complete these steps before installing it. You just copy this command to your terminal and install all the required libraries and set up the Flogo command line tool. You can also follow the getting started section to get your first Flogo app up and running via the command line. Now let's create a quick app using the CLI. First let's type Flogo create my app to set up your app. Once that's done, we can add our triggers and activities. Now you add your log activity that will display our hello world message. Next we'll add our HTTP trigger that will kick off our flow. Now we have all the components used by our flow, so we'll go ahead and add the flow we created earlier in the web UI and now we can build our app. Let's go to the bin directory to start our app. You'll notice that there's a triggers.json file. You'll have to configure this first. There's an example of one in the getting started section of the Flogo CLI GitHub repo. Now we can start our app. Now we can use a simple curl command to test our app using the port and path specified when we configured our trigger. If you'll notice our hello world message is now displayed on the console. For more information, please visit flogo.io or our GitHub repo at github.com slash tibcosoftware slash flogo. Thank you.